Hey guys, how are you? Good evening. Everything good. Everything good? Hey, everything good. Good teacher. Nice, nice. Good to see you guys. All right, good to see you. So, anyways, guys, what uh, I was, you know, same question, right? So, how was work today? Do you work from home, by the way? Where, where do you work from? Good, good teacher. Good for me. And I maybe uh, I prepare. Um, I one more time. I I was prepare another kind of document for uh, Ministry of Economy, right? And oh, after. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh really? Minister, yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Give me one second. One second, I'm sorry. Okay. Late. All right, guys. So, um, anyways, good to see you here. Uh, so you were preparing. You were, you say you were preparing papers. What's what's that sound? <laughs> that sounds like a ship. It, it was a working uh, budget. Um, you were working on. You were working on what? I'm sorry. Budget. Budget. What is that? Budget and you no know, presupuesto. Budget. Oh, budget. 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 Yes. Budget, right? Budget. Yes. Budget. Uh huh. Budget. Okay, uh, uh, mo uh, a quantity of money and the budget yes. to buy uh, <laughs> to, to buy, buy what equipment, uh, technology oh. equipment. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's great! That's great. Okay, great. That's pretty good. Uh, what about you, Miguel? Hey, how was your day? Hey, that's cool. Everything good. Everything good. But <laughs> we are. Uh, thinking about the weekend, how to finish this this work in the in the yeah, tomorrow. Wait, but, what are you, what are you what are you talking about? Uh, because I work with a quality inspection. Oh, in the factory. Okay, okay yeah, gotcha. I had to I, I had to finish the to inspect the songs, push your order for the factory. All right. Okay. All right. Yeah, I got you. Got you. Got you. Okay. So. Uh, Oh, I didn't know that. That's that's very cool, man. That's pretty pretty cool. Yeah. And uh, so so um, so, but but you don't. I mean, you have to go to your workplace. You don't work from home, do you? Uh, nowadays, I don't work from home. I have to visit some factories. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Okay. Yeah. All right. Hey, let me ask you something, guys. Hello, welcome back, Mirna. Nice to see you. So, hello. So, uh, nice. Welcome, welcome, guys. What is that, Louis? Is that a is that a ship? It sounds like a sounds like a ship. I have no idea what that is. I forgot what I was gonna ask you, man. I was gonna ask you something else. All right, guys. I uh try to be early, guys, so we can you know start early earlier too all right but thank you very much for being here um how are you how are you kalena here now how was your day everything good yeah the same of the other day <laughs> all right university homework i'm i'm in my room because air conditioner <laughs> <laughs> no i can't go out Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But you have air conditioning, right? Yeah, but it's not turned out right now. Oh my god, it's been really, really hot, guys. It's been so hot lately. I I hear it's cold. Yeah, of course, right? You you're rich. You have air conditioning. 
Oh, no, I don't have air conditioner right now. I don't have. Like, no, but not right now, but you do have one. I mean, you could turn it on if you want it, right? Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, very good. Kalena, how are you? How was your day? How was your day with your kids? I'm fine. You're Thank good? You. Yes. All right. All right. Do I you feel, like? I feel tired. I feel tired, but I, I don't know why. <laughs> because. Welcome to my world. I all I always feel tired. <laughs> now I I do. You know what? I do need to exercise. Uh, because I I used to exercise like often, but now having too much work. <clears throat> you know, it's I don't like to say we don't have time. You know, it's just that we are not well organized. You know, you always have time. You're just not organized, right? So, um, so the few minutes I get, because I have a, you know, I just have uh, you know some few minutes. Um, then, you know, I could do something, right? But then I feel like super, super sleepy and, and you know, that gets me down. So that's, uh, that's what- Right uh, now I feel sleepy too. <laughs> yeah, no, I bet, I bet, okay. Hey, where are these guys, okay? Mm, I'm gonna tell their moms. I'm gonna tell your moms uh, when you come late, guys. Kalena le voy a decir tu mamá. <laughs> how are you paco nice to see you alejandro how are you good to see you guys good to see you good evening everyone good to see you how was your day paco i was very busy it was busy today i went to uh Costa Dorada, that's in a watch and plan. Yeah, unfortunately, I am ready for the meeting tonight. All right, okay, good. Okay, Costa Dorada, I've never heard of that. I've never even, even been to a watch and plan. That's too far for me. Uh, I should go, you know, I should write. It, it's just, you know, I, I like writing. I like going out, guys. I love going out. Uh, sometimes, you know, because I don't know El Salvador too well, I don't like going too far alone because what happens is that if I get lost, you know, I might get lost in a very dangerous area, right? So then I don't know. And that's the thing, right? I mean, I don't I don't care about like the streets and anything, but I might get into a um into a um, an area, right? A zone where you know you have a lot of gangs and, and everything. I'm sorry, were you gonna say something? Where are you from? Uh you, I, you mean where do I live? Sorry, well, I, 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 I didn't hear. You mean where I live? I, I live in, in Tecla. Ah, <laughs> okay. Prin, you, Princess you live in City. <laughs> you live in Salvador. Okay, the capital. Okay. No, 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 I live in Santa Tecla. Okay. I, that's a, that's a, Santa Tecla is part of La Libertad. Right? So you get lost in San Salvador? No, 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 I, not in San Salvador, no. Uh, I don't, I don't, I, I mean, I, I I know a lot of places, you know, because I travel a lot. But there are some places I don't know, and I've got I've been I gotten lost before, in an area which is not too safe, you know, like a dangerous area, right? So, so I I want you know I went to Suchitoto one of these days, and I ended up going through Santa Lucia and, and Matasano, you know. So those are the things I don't like. If you know if you know those places, you know what I'm talking about, right? So it's it's dangerous so <laughs> anyways guys so let's get started okay all right um where is i think we're missing who are we missing because we're missing quite a few all right <clears throat> so guys uh before we start guys midterm is ready right you're you're completing uh section number four now right yes all right Regardless, guys, of your completion of the platform, if you complete section number four or not, we need to keep, uh, you need to keep coming to class because uh, grammar, I mean, the class is here, right? It's, uh, it's not only for you to complete the platform, guys, okay? All right, it's for you to practice and learn something every day. All right, guys, so today, all right, today we're going to talk about something very cool, all right? We're going to talk about have and get, okay? And um, why is this important? I don't know. No, it is very important, guys. It is very important because uh, this is actually, guys, how you 
um, this is actually something that is hard to understand for a lot of Spanish speakers, okay? Because get, guys, have you can use get in a lot of ways, you know? It's a verb that can be used in a lot of ways. And have, guys, uh, can be used in the same way as get, you know, sometimes. Uh, these are called, guys, causative verbs, okay? We're gonna, so we're going to talk about, okay? So today, guys, we're going to focus on, we're going to focus on have, okay? But, all right, help me read, guys. So what's the objective for today? Yes, go ahead. By the end of, of this class, participants will be able to describe a service performed for them by someone else using have or get. All right, very good, guys. Okay, in, 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 in Spanish terms, this is what we call if you want to have choleros, okay? <laughs> it's true, guys. All right. So they, this is what it is, guys, you know, you know, have you ever had someone do something for you? Have you ever, you know, had you like, have, who has, who has siblings here, guys? Do you have brothers or sisters? All right. Have you ever asked them to do something for you? Have you ever tell them, hey, bichito, mira, anda, treme, tres cuartos de tortilla. Yes? No? Yes. No, I'm the no. little one. I'm the little you're, chico. Oh, you're... <laughs> the yeah, chico. me too. I'm the, I'm the little. Okay, uh, okay. Have you ever had your 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 siblings ordering you something? You know, I mean, ordering something uh, to you, like like for example, you know, giving you orders. Okay, that's what I mean. All right. So, have you ever had that? Uh, your brother or sister giving you orders? Dando te órdenes? Yes or no? Yes, all the time. All the when time. I was little, right? Yeah. right not, now, anymore. No. not anymore. No, not, not anymore. <laughs> what if what if they asked you to to do that nowadays? Would you do it? Yes, always. Yeah. Oh, you you still love your brothers then? Your, yes. Your brother, Please make you and make me a sandwich. Please. Make oh, and you would do it like yeah, whatever. And I am the 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 cholera. <laughs> the, what do you say? <laughs> All uh, right, that's nice. That's very nice. So, 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 uh, so you get along with your brothers. All right, very good, guys. So that's what the topic is about, guys. Okay, right about being choleros. <laughs> no, um, the topic is about guys getting someone else to do something for you, and which is called, you know, in colloquial terms, cholero, right? <laughs> and and um, but yeah, guys. Okay, so so that's you know how we can use how we can use get right and have. Okay. So how can we do that? All right, let's uh, let's take a look at it. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna know guys how to get something no uh, done. I'm sorry, and uh, we're gonna practice. All right, so warm up. Okay, um, so let's see. All right, help me read uh, Paco Rivas. Help me read, sir. Okay, warm up. Have you ever had someone do something for you? Let's practice. Do you know where I can get someone cut my hair? Do you know where I can get someone cut my hair? All right, very good. Repeat, guys. Do you know where I can get someone cut my hair? Do you know where, you know where I can get, get someone, someone cut, cut my, my, hair. my hair? All right, very good. Okay, what I'm asking you here, guys, is, hey, do you know someone who cuts hair for me? Okay, I want someone to cut my hair. That's what I'm asking here, okay? Right. I think you need someone to cut your beard. My beard? Uh, que alguien me corte mi oso? <laughs> how, do you, how do you pronounce? Beard. Beer? Beer? Be no, not beer. Beer is? A <laughs> drink. Uh, drink. Medicine, right? Medicine, right? A, a drink. Uh -huh. para el alma, right? Medicine. Right? That is okay. beer. Beard. Da, 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 da. Repeat beard. A uh, bird. Beard. Kind of, beard. kind of bird, but beard. not a bird like beard. bird. No beard. Repeat beard. That's that is beard. Ah, uh, beard. That is that is uh, this. This is beard, right? Oh, right. Beard. yeah. That's that's beard. a very tough for me to to pronounce because it's very similar, like the uh, like beard. 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 Yeah, you know beard. the uh, beard. the the dove. You know, let me add, let me tell you something. I was going to have someone trim my 
Oh my god, guys! I don't know what I what I've come down with. Um, uh, trim my beard today, you know. All right, I was gonna have someone trim my beard today, but and this is a real story, guys. I'm not I'm not inventing this, right? Uh, but I didn't have time, you know, because I work a lot. So. Well, I had time, yes, but I, well, I do. I did have something else to do, so I didn't have time. You are a workaholic. I, I'm, I'm not a workaholic. It's just I like money. <laughs> <laughs> I like money, so. You're money maker. Uh, not, not, not as, not as much as I would love to, but, but yeah, you know, I, I like. I, and we know we all need to make money, right? So that's the reason. I, I mean, if I were, if I was make, were making more money, you know, without working this much, then I would do the same, right? But unfortunately, you know, right, I had to work a lot. <laughs> so, um, and I also study, and that's the thing, you know. So it's, I have like three, like my, my day is like super, super busy, which is, you know, it's good too because then you know. You don't think about anything else, you know. You don't think about problems. You don't think about anything else. You don't think about anyone. You just think about your studies, your job. You know, your mind doesn't have any more time to think about anything else, right? So I, that's a good thing. So, um, all right. So here, guys. Okay, I was going to have someone train my beard today, but I didn't have time. <clears throat> all right. Notice, okay. Who was gonna? Uh, was I going to cut my beard, or I mean, was I going to trim? What is the difference between trim and cut, guys? Trim is when you cut, but you still keep it. Very cut good, okay. is when you when you take it out. Uh, well, that's that's the way I could describe it. When you remove it, you mean? Yeah. It's yeah, when you like move. Remove it, okay. When you remove. Yeah. So, so, so trim, guys. Okay, right. Uh, Mirna, did you get the, the the meaning of that? Trim. Or not yet. Ah. Uh. Mm, I don't know. It's like a uh, hmm. when you I'll remove, tell you all. remove all the breed. <laughs> so 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 here, okay. So so here is. I've always wanted to have red beard, okay, a red beard. So this is my beard, okay. So this is me, or a quick representation of my beard. <laughs> right. Hey, this is this is actually pretty good, right? All right. Sure. Mm -hmm. All right. So this is me, guys. Okay. All right. So this is me, and I am. I am my. I have curly hair, guys. But all right, anyways. All right. So this is me, guys. Okay. So um, I should have more. Okay, over here. Okay. So trimming, trimming is doing this. So see. All right. So this is the beard. When you trim your beard, when when you trim your beard, guys, is when you do this. Uh, it's like doing this, see? Eh? Oh, well, that didn't work out. <laughs> but it's just like like going shorter, you know? Your your beard is going to be shorter now. Uh, and it's is recortar, teacher. Thank you very much, Google Translate, right? So it's going like <laughs> this, guys, okay, right? Got it? So if it was like this, right? Now it's like this, got it? So that is trimming. So I was going to trim my beard today. So what I was telling you guys is that, what I was saying, I'm sorry, is that I was going to have someone trim my beard today so was i the one going was was i the one uh uh who was gonna train trim my beard or was somebody else going to trim my beard what do you think was somebody else going to trim my beard or was i going to trim my beard quien iba a cortarme la pers otra persona o yo mismo somebody say, else oh, Somebody right, else. Somebody somebody else, else. Right? Very good. Okay, so let's answer this question. Miguel, do you know where I can get someone cut my hair? Uh, maybe a barber shop. Okay, all right. All right, so you can say this, okay? You can get your hair cut at a barber shop. Repeat, you can get your hair you cut. You can get your, your hair cut at a barber shop. At a barber shop. Okay, or you can say, guys, you can have, right? Uh, you can have your hair cut at a barber shop, okay? Very good. Um, let's see. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. 
Alejandro, okay? All right. Do you know where I can get someone to... Uh, do you know where I can get someone um, <clears throat> to uh, fix my car? In, in a workshop, maybe? All right. I need a full sentence, okay? All right. Let's try a full uh, sentence. Um... You can get someone to fix your car in a workshop. At a workshop, okay? At a workshop. At a workshop. Okay. Good job, guys. Good job, good job, okay? All right, guys. So this is, this is okay, this is the uh, how we use this, okay? All right, so uh, thank you. All right. Alejandro, if you're so kind, help me read, Alejandro. Okay. So how do we have something done? Okay. Today, let's have a look at two ways we use the auxiliary verb have in English grammar. You can have your watch repair, repaired or have someone repair your watch. Simple, simple, right? Well, today I will show you both of these grammar patterns. Very good, okay. All right, guys. So let's take a look at the first example, guys, and then we're gonna go over the structure, okay? All right, um, na, 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 na. E, uh, Janet, okay, Janet, help me read the first example, Janet. You are muted, mal de teacher. There you go. I man. want to have my watch repaired. Repeat, I want, repeat, I want. I want. To have my watch uh -huh. repaired. My watch repaired. All right, very good, okay. I wanna have my watch repaired. All right, good job, guys. All right, so, uh, so he, see you guys, okay, we're using have. And what do we have here? What is this, guys? What is that in grammar, my watch? The subject. It is a noun, right? Ah, it's a noun, yeah. <laughs> okay, all right. The subject is I, right? So anyways, in that, that, in that case, that would be the object, which is also a noun, right? Uh, repaired, okay? And what is repaired, guys, in grammar? It is a verb, past verb. A verb in the past? Are you sure? No. In, uh, it's acting as an adjective? Um, no, it's not acting as an adjective, no. Um, is the complement? Well, yes, it is a complement. But... No, it's not an Okay, do not be guessing, guys. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, no, 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 son dulces. No, no, it's not, right? It's not. You have to uh, think about it, okay? Right. What are the three forms of the verbs that we have, guys? Uh, it's a, okay, it's a have... past participle. Form. It is a past participle, right? So we have repair. All right, which is repair. All right, and then we have repaired, and then we have repaired too, right? Because it's a regular verb. So the, the, the past participle of repair is repair. The simple past of repair is repaired too, right? So, uh, so when I say I want to have my watch repaired, I'm uh, talking, you know, uh, repair is, uh, is actually a past participle, okay? Now, um, <clears throat> Janet, no, not you, yes. Janet. Um, Janet, pick someone, pick someone who is wearing light blue and taking notes um, in her notebook and wearing glasses. Okay. Um, let me see. Yes, Irena. Uh, Irena, there you go, Irena. Thank you very much, Irena. All right. Uh, Irena, let's go. Our example number two, and I want you to determine the parts of the the parts of the structure that we have here. The part of the structure. You can yes. have your hair cut at the barber for just ten dollars. Repeat, okay. Cut, not cut, cut. Cut. Yes, okay. You can have your hair cut, cut yes. at the barber for just $10. Very good, okay, right? So, no, okay, very good. So, so uh, remember, right, we have have here. Okay, and then your hair, what is your hair? 
the subject. A noun. A noun. A noun. It's, a noun. It's, a, it's a noun, right? It's a noun, which is also, guys, okay? This is the object of the sentence, right? By the way, All right? It's the object, right? And then we have cut, which is the verb in what form? As participle. Simple. As participle, guys, right? Remember, what is the present of cut? Cut, sorry. Cut, cut, cut. Cut, cut. Cut, cut, right? Cut, 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 right? Cut, cut, cut. All right, so that is the present form, guys, okay? All right, so let's delve a little bit more into the, uh, <laughs> hey, that, 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 that isn't bad, huh? All right, so let's have the, um, actually, guys, it's actually a good resemblance. <laughs> Bin Laden, right? Bin Laden. Bin David, all right? <laughs> so, <laughs> hey, guys, by the way, you have to remember my name because you're going to have a survey, right? In the survey, you're gonna have you're gonna have the name of your of uh, your instructor, right? So, and what is your last name? I just have your name. David. All right, Bukele. No. <laughs> really? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. So that's my name, guys. Okay. So, anyways, so now it's just. Okay. I más común no puedo ser, guys. Okay? So, <laughs> no. Yeah, more generic, right? So, anyways, right? so anyways, okay. So let's talk about the structure, guys. Okay. So uh, let's talk about have. Okay, we're gonna talk about get later, guys. But let's uh, let's talk about have here. So all right. So it teacher how and uh, get the same meaning. Okay, yes. but in, in this I'm, sense, get can be used for a lot of oh. things. But right now, yeah. I'm gonna teach you about have. Okay, we're gonna get into get later. All right. Okay. So, um, so very good, guys. So the let's talk about the the structure. Um, let's talk about the structure, guys. All right. So first off, guys, I need I need what? If I say okay, uh, I I, I can't have my hair cut by 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 Chayanne. So what do I need? For, what is the first part that that you hear? Uh, hair subject or pronoun? Very good. Okay, so we need a subject. Uh, yeah. Okay. Now within the subject, guys. Okay, you can use a noun or a pronoun, right? So a subject. Okay, very good. Then what do I need, guys? The, the auxiliary. Very good. You need a very good. I, I really love the fact that you said auxiliary. Okay. It's all guys, auxiliary, not ow, right? Auxiliary. Okay? <laughs> auxiliary. No, but, but, but no, I really love this because you said auxiliary. You didn't say uh, can or you didn't say, you know, um, might. Right. Yeah, exactly. So auxiliary, right? So here, guys, you can even, even say that you, you, you can use a model if you want, right? But let's call it auxiliary. Okay. So, so um, all right, we're we're gonna I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you more examples than that. All right, what else? What else do we need here, guys? Have or get? Okay. A noun. Very good. Have. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, we need have. Oh, here, yeah. okay? Now, what if we're talking about Shakiro? Shakiro, right? If we're talking, what if we're talking about Shakiro, guys? <laughs> Can it, does this change? Oh, it changes. It changes? You're or sure? not. Not? I no. don't know. You tell me. I don't know. <laughs> you no, tell th me. Does it... <laughs> Maybe uh, in this case, the it, verb, it, 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 it the doesn't same. change, I think. I screwed it up. The same how for all. I have to redo it. Um, so you think that, you, okay, so do we keep it or do we change it? Subject plus... <laughs> Okay, all right, plus have. Uh, okay, so so I uh, so you can can Chayanne say can we say Chayanne needs someone to cut her hair his 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 hair or he needs someone well Chayanne needs wait 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 wait, wait, wait. we're doing something wrong here okay uh, Chayanne can have or can has can have. 
exchanges it for a mora. No, because we had a mora. Exactly. There you go. There you go. Ooh, all right, Marina, you're on fire. Okay. Good job, Marina. Okay. So, yes. Uh, so, you can say uh, subject, right? Subject plus model. And this hap does not change, guys. Okay. So mm -hmm. This doesn't change at all, right? All right. Then what do we have after hap, guys? A noun. Okay, right. You need the object of the sentence, which can be a noun, right? It can either be a noun or a pronoun if you want, guys, okay? But let's go for a noun now, okay? Well, actually, I'll teach you with a pronoun, too, okay? I'll give you examples with pronouns, okay? All right, so a noun or a pronoun, okay? Then what else, guys? What else do we need? Um, Complement. The first book, bro. Okay. Um... Now here it depends, guys. It depends on what um, what you're talking about, right? You can say she can have someone prepare his his computer, or he can have his cat his car repaired. Okay. So here, guys, it depends. If, you know, if you're talking in the present or in the past, right? So here, guys, you need a verb, right? Usually, past participle. So I'm gonna teach you about past participle verbs, okay? But but this depends, right? All right, it depends on um, if you're talking about um, in what tense you're talking about. Today we're gonna focus, right, on past participle verbs, and then I'll teach you about the other ones. Okay. All right. So after this, uh, what do what else do we need, guys? Compliment. Okay. All right. So you need a compliment, right? Compliment. All right. Very good, guys. So this is, you know, the recipe, right? This is la receta, right? This is, uh, this is it, okay? So, all right, so let's take a look at an example, okay? All right, somebody give me a subject. Baby. All right, baby, all right? Let's go with baby, all right, baby. Baby, baby uh huh? No, baby. No, baby. Teacher. Okay, right, let's go you with. You didn't listen very well. Baby, okay. Baby? David. David. All right, David. Know. Your right. name, teacher. All right, all right, your name. Okay, your name, right. All right, David. Okay, let's teacher, go with David. Please huh? be serious, teacher. David, David, David. I, well, I'm, I'm teaching you how to pronounce it, right? <laughs> all right, let's go. David, what? David. Not David. 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 And it can, uh, can. Uh, David, David can, okay. David can what? Can how? All right, very good. All right, continue, Irina. Thank you, uh, Louis. Continue, Irina. David can have? David can have um, this a noun or a pronoun? No. Okay, uh, I'm sorry. Let me interrupt you for a moment, uh, Irina. Here, guys, you can use a noun or a, or a pronoun, okay? But to be more specific, to, to, to you know, simplify this, let's use, um, you need to talk about something, okay? I need you to talk about something, okay? Well, Why am I saying that? I so, say so you don't refer to a person, okay? Let's not refer to a person. Now, okay. there is a way to say that, guys, but right now, let's talk about one thing, right? So go ahead. Uh, uh can I say can have a car? Yeah, you can say he can, right, David can have a car. All right, or okay. his car. Are you can have his house? car. Can have Very good. Can car. have his car. Uh, repaired. Very good. Okay, so here, guys, she's using the past participle, right? If you're gonna use an object, guys, okay, repaired. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, now. There is something else that we can add here, guys, in the compliment, okay? You can mention in the compliment, guys, you can mention, all right? You can mention this, by, okay? By, and then you have to mention someone here, okay? So a noun or a pronoun, guys, okay? By, by. the mechanic. Mm -hmm. or, or you can use, or you can mention not, not someone, guys, but something too, right? By, by the, uh, by the, by the car shop, right? Repair shop, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> All right, but David can have his car repaired by a mechanic. Okay, good job. Thank you. Applause for Irina, guys. Thank you, Irina. Thank you. All right, very good. Okay, so uh, let's see. 
Rafael, let's go, Rafael. Hello, teacher. Hello, sir. You know, hello. actually, hello, Rafael. All right, actually, guys, last person to turn on the camera. Okay, that's going to be my participant. Let's go. Five, four, three. Let's turn on those cameras, guys, because you're whoever has it off at the end has been turned off at the end is going to be my participant. Aha, uh -huh. Blanca, Sonia, Lenin, loud at one. Uh -huh. All right, very good, guys. So uh, I'll pick, okay, right? We got one, we got Ali, right? Sonia, all right, hey, Sonia, give me an example, Sonia. <laughs> Let's start with a subject, Sonia. Okay. <laughs> all right. I'll help you. All right, continue with the rest. Yeah, yeah. All right, so let's go with yeah. Chan. Chan's going to be our subject today, so surprise, surprise, right? Um, so Chayan, what? Oh. Chayan. Let's use a model verb, okay? Uh, give me any model verb. Well, not you cannot use all models, guys. But but let's use let's use can or or will if you want. Can. Okay, so Cheyenne can. Okay, all right, very good. And then can we need have. can have. Very good. All right, and then what else? Can have. Uh -huh. Help her, guys. Help her. Help her. Everybody, help her. Can have what? Can have come to sing to El Salvador? No. Yeah. No. Remember, we need something, right? Chan can have and we need the something. All right, what is that something that we're going to have here, guys? His song. Okay, can have his, okay, his, his song. Okay, his song, what? So, Cheyenne by, can have his song, what? By, uh, by, Zoom, from, by Zoom meeting? No, this is not a, from, this, this is not a verb. This is not a verb. Song is not a verb. Okay. No. By a family, by a man. The song of song. Recorder. Okay, right, song. Okay, he can by, have songs. By, song. by his fan. Oh, yeah. Very song. good. By his fans. Nice. On fire, Marina. Good job, Marina. All right, very good. All right, now here, guys. Okay, there's something else that I want to point out. When we say Cheyenne can have his song sung, okay, right? Let's repeat that. Song, listen, right? Let me ask you this, guys. Do you hear the same pronunciation? Song. Song. All right, listen, just first listen, okay? And tell me if you hear the same. Song. 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 Do you hear the same or do you hear two different things? Song. Song, guys. <laughs> It's not sangha, sangano, no. It's not sangano, guys, right? Sangha. No, 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 no. Sangano, uh, you're toxic, right? No. Uh, <laughs> all right. Song, okay, right. It's actually, guys, the shape of the mouth. It is the same O sound, right? But in the first example, guys, when we say this, repeat, you have to take a look at my mouth, guys. It is the shape of an O, right? Song. Repeat. Song. Song, song right? Song. All right, Sorry. the shape of the mouth, guys, is an O, right? Now, I'm going to say the same O, but I'm going to smile, okay? Song, see? Song. 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 Okay, very song. good. Song, song. All right, song, song. Song, song. All right, song, song. Okay, song, song. Okay, so Chayan can have his song sung by his fans, okay? All right, that's how you pronounce it, guys, okay? Very good. Um, that was a great example. Okay, right. Let's have another example. Uh, let's try to use some, uh, some other models. Okay. Um, 
give me a subject, okay? I need any, uh, uh, I need somebody else to give me a subject. Who wants to give me another subject, guys? Just a subject, okay? Nothing else so far. For now, I'm sorry. Bon Jovi, for example. Okay, right. Bon, bon Jo. All right, I'm going to call him Bon Jo. All right, so Bon, bon Jo, guys, okay? <clears throat> All right, Bon Jo. So Bon, no, jo bon what, Jovi, what, guys? Bon Jovi. All right, I'll change it. I'll bon Jo. How do you spell Jovi? Jovi like that? Jovi? No, no. Jovi. We, yes. uh, yeah, you're right. All right. I like I like Bon Jovi, uh, Bon Jovi, uh, and I didn't know how to spell his name. <laughs> all right, so Bon Jovi, okay. Um, all right, Bon Jovi, what guys? <laughs> yes, Bon Jovi. <laughs> will, let's use Will, guys. Hey, why don't we try some other models, okay? Bon Jovi, Will, Bon Jovi, Will, what? But Javi will very good. Okay, right there you go. Have guys. Okay, guys, just follow the structure. Just sigan la 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 estructura, guys. Okay, all right. Just follow the instructions. Bon Javi will have. All right. Now give me an object. Okay. Give give me a. And I'm actually talking about a real object. Alejandro, give me give me something that Bon Javi will have. Um, a new album. That's too boring. His wife, okay? Let's talk about his wife, okay? Okay. <laughs> All right, so Bon Jovi, but, but a new album, that's good. Thank you, Alejandro. That would have been good too. Bon Jovi will have his wife. Well, let's go. His wife, I'm sorry. Bon Jovi will have his wife what? Well, okay, what, what if she wants to get some... Um, some surgery, plastic surgery. Oh, what can I say? Lovely. What? Love it. Will have his life, his wife loved. Loved by whom, man? <laughs> Love it by. Traveled. By a good personality. Wait, Bon Jovi will have his wife travel, traveled. <laughs> That's it. So you're saying Bon Jovi va a tener a su esposa viajada. So who's gonna travel his wife? That sounds so bad, right? No, okay. You have to, you have to use a verb that makes sense, right? We'll have his wife. Bon Jovi will have his next concert in love. The next month. Hold on, hold on. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, Bon Jovi will have his next concert in in, in the next month. That is a that is a good sentence, but that, that has nothing to do with this with this uh, with this uh, topic. You, Mirna, you said Bon Jovi, I mean, uh, will have his wife Thank what? Uh, bon Jovi will have his wife in love by the rest of the life. <laughs> by the rest of her life, okay? This is a good one, okay? Good job. Bon Jovi mm -hmm. will have his wife in love by the rest of his life. Bon Jovi va a tener su esposa enamorada por el resto de su vida. Oh, that's very good, mm -hmm. right? Uh, that's very good. Right. Congratulations. Mirna. Thanks. <laughs> teacher Mirna. Now she's teacher Mirna now, guys. Okay. A teacher Mirna. That's great. Teacher, not teacher. Camiseta. Right? She's not teacher. She's not like camisetas, right? I am. Teacher. Camisetas. All right, very good. All right. So uh, give me another example. Uh, who wants to give me another example, guys? Um, let's choose. Uh, uh, Kalena, right? Kalena, give me another example. Kalena. Actually, guys, do me a favor. Everybody else, send me one example, guys, in the chat room. Everybody, send me one example in the chat room right now. Kalena, give me your example, please. Okay. My mom can have um, oh, my, I don't know if I can do that. My mom can have my son to karate class. Okay, hold on, right? Can have no. I don't know. You 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 read the structure and you tell me. My mom can have. Now um, you can you can use okay, guys. There is another structure. I'm gonna teach you about the other structure too, right? There are a lot of things that we need to learn about this. Right now, let's focus on the one structure that I'm teaching you, okay? 
yes, you can have, my mom can have his son learn karate, you know? Yeah, you could say that, but that is that changes the structure, okay? Right now, I want you to focus on this, okay? After have, you need something, right? You need an object. All right. Mm -hmm. So so let's not use a person this time. All right. Just for the sake of keeping this simple, let's use something. Okay. So what is the something? Okay. Kalina, tell me something. My mom can have can have um, talk about a possession. Right. Think about guys. Think about a possession. Okay. Uh, Kalina, think about your mom's possessions uh, money you can have okay her money very good okay good job all right my mom my can son. have her money all right no 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 follow the structure follow the structure follow the structure money. Save it. Part is both. Save it. Save it. Save it. okay all right saved okay thank all right. you <laughs> thank all right my mom can have her money saved by the bank at, at the bank bye okay bye the, the bank. bank okay good job mm -hmm. Pulsar, Kalina and Irena. thank you Irena, for helping okay. thank you Irena. Good job. applause guys applause applause right mm -hmm. right very good okay all right good job uh, Kalina pick someone else who has not participated I can see no one I just see you oh okay right all right, all right. that's okay that's okay right I'll pick um I don't know, guys, you want to try it? How about you, Laura? Are you there, Laura? Laura Ramos? Yes, I'm oh, you, hello. Yeah, I... Uh -huh. I think your internet is kind of lagging, you know? Okay. Uh, Messi can have his T-shirt designed by... Uh, Carolina Herrera, no. Designed by by herself. Okay, no. right. Yeah, that's self. That's okay. That's yes. That himself. Himself. That would be himself. Okay. Or you can say Man, Messi can have his T-shirt designed by Cheyenne, right? No, let's change that to himself. Okay, himself. Very good, Laura. That's very good. Applause for Laura, guys. Good job, Laura. All right, that's great. Okay. So Messi okay. can have his T-shirt designed by himself, right? T-shirt. Right? So, teacher. Teacher. Yeah, teacher, right? Yes. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> uh, we can use uh, for or any preposition. What or do you mean? And where? By. Where? Instead of by? Yeah, inside of by. It depends on what you're gonna say next. Uh, Messi can okay. have his teach his teach. I was gonna say teacher because you're getting me confused. <laughs> uh, so Messi can have his T-shirt design. Uh, uh, let's see, design with love. See, it, it depends, right? If you're not gonna talk about someone else, like if you're gonna say. It's not a different idea, you know. You can say, you know, what you can say in this case, right? Uh, by love, right? But because by love is not someone, right, or something. By love, love is just an idea. So, with love, right? With care, you can use with, right? Um, or you can say, Messi will have his T-shirt designed for her, for his wife. But in this case, it means that he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna design. <clears throat> I mean, he's not gonna. Oh my God, it's not gonna, um, we don't know who's gonna design the t-shirt. Guys, see, okay, I'm gonna write, write it down here, guys. If we say, that's a good question here, Mirna. All right, uh, what was it? Oh yeah, Messi will have his t-shirt, t-shirt, like you called me, right? Uh, Messi will have his t-shirt designed <laughs> for, his wife here guys okay what is the difference between saying for his wife than by his wife is his wife going to design the t-shirt 
No, he's gonna make it uh, for his so, wife. It, I it mean, exactly. Uh -huh, go ahead. Yeah, I meant uh, it will be a present just for her for her okay, wife. Applause, so. applause, guys. Good job, Paco. All right. Very good. The difference, guys, is that in the first example, Messi will have his T-shirt designed for his wife. We're talking about him gifting her uh, a T-shirt, right? All right, pretty much. And when we say, guys, uh, Messi will have his T-shirt designed by his wife, that means that the designer will be his wife, right? So to answer your question, yes, we can use more prepositions. However, they completely change the meaning. Today we're focusing on by though, but, but good question, okay? Very good, very good, okay. All right, very good, guys. Another question, guys, any other question? All right, very good, okay. Um, do you need more examples or are we good? Do you want more examples? Teacher. Tell me. I have uh, some, some problems with the platform mm -hmm. using this kind of, of of sentence or answers you mean or answers yes because um in the exercise um see on the i think the last part it says uh, complete the suggestion for possible solutions mm -hmm. and and the first one says on oh, the first one is good let me see and the, the second first one, one first for example one. says table computers in parentheses, it says be used in every home. And I and I use and I answer will have use and and I try with all possibilities, but those are wrong. I don't right. know what is the correct. Can you help? I'll, me? I'll, yes, absolutely. Um, I'll give. I'll, I'll take the last few minutes, minutes, guys, to to help you with the the, uh, the platform. Okay. Uh, thank you for bringing that up. Actually, that's very important. I'm just going to check your example, guys. Guys, everybody needs to send me an example, right? Everyone, right? I don't see everybody here. Uh, Paco, unfortunately, I'm having unstable connection. Oh, that's okay. That was not an example. The voice is No, no I, I, I wrote that at the beginning of the, of the class. Okay, right. Got it. Got it. Yeah. Uh, there is my example in the chat. You can, I can read it for you. Um... Yeah, we yeah. will have our English course done by first week of August. Very good. Okay. That's almost good. That, that was almost perfect. We will have our English first course uh, done by the first. Okay. You're missing the, the article that. The first oh, okay. Week by the August. first. Yeah. The first week oh, of August. Okay. Okay. okay right, let me job. fix Len it. Lenin says, my son. Remember to meet yourselves, guys. All right. My son can have his dog healthy. No, um, it's not healthy. Can have his dog. Um, re, uh, can have his dog. Right, it's just that the, 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 the action here, can have his dog taken care by a veterinarian, okay? Taken care of by a veterinarian, okay? So my son can have his dog taken care of by a veter uh, veterinarian, okay? Veterinarian, right? So taking care of, that's what you are missing there. Miguel, I will have a lot of money saved, but uh, in the bank at the end of the month. Very good. Michael Bolton can have can have very good music by his song. All right, no, no, Blanca. This is this is this is not the right structure, Blanca. Um, Mirna, my dog will have my money possessed for the rest of his life. Okay, okay, all right. My dog, I mean, my money, okay, uh, no, this is wrong actually, okay? Because my dog will have my money possessed, right? By the rest of his life. You're, it's the other way around, okay? My money um, will be possessed by my dog by the rest of his life. Okay, it's the other way around because, right? Otherwise, the idea doesn't make sense. My brother, uh, Alejandro, my brother will have his new phone damaged by the end of the week. <laughs> Good. Kalena can have her computer repaired by a workshop. Good job, Blanca. Diego Sinner can have many flaws. That's not the, the example. 
Um, you can have your house fixed by the carpenter. Good job, Luis. Okay, good job, guys. All right, you did a good job, guys. Thank you. And plus for you guys, well done. All right, well done. All right, good, 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 good job. All right. Now, um, let's. Uh, I'm gonna help you with the platform. Okay. Good job, guys. I'm proud of you. Very proud of you guys. All right. So tell me. All right. So tell me which one do you need help with? What? What? Which one was it? In, in my case, part e, B, part one, part two. Okay, so so you're talking about the midterm? Yeah, midterm. Okay, so let's take a look at the midterm. Part one and part two, letter B, B. All right, very good. So we got part one. No, letter B. Okay, because of the time, guys, I'm just going to show you the answers, okay? These are super easy. What, what, so what are you... What are your answers, Luis? Because these ones are super, okay. super easy. Yes, I know, but I don't know what happened with the, the platform. No, yeah. no, yeah. no, 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 no. This, okay, Maybe, so let's take a look at this. Uh -huh, this is the path, for example, there. Oh, it's correct, see? Uh-huh. So you're doing something wrong? Right. No, oh, no, okay. So okay. what, make sure, make, guys, don't make sure that you do not put an extra for, space, okay? If uh, you put an extra space, all right, it's for not example, gonna take I, I I was working uh, put complete the sentences. They are scratch, um, but not scratch. It's not scratch. scratch. Only except scratched. only one only one word. Yes, dent. Yes. Uh, for example, in this case, dent. Dented. Uh huh. Yeah, it's the, the the answer. Right. What, what happened with this 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 verb dent is is at the past participle and my new car is dented. It has a dent. That's a that's a noun. That's not a past participle verb. Uh-huh. I answered your question just now. Oh. Dent is not a verb. Dent is a noun. Mm -hmm. No? Okay. All right, very good. So so uh so here are the answers, guys. Okay. All right, lo que te acabo de explicar, Luis, es que dent en este caso no es un verbo, es un sustantivo. Quiere decir mi carro está dented. Tiene un dent, no, no sé cómo traducir eso, guys, no sé, ya me acuerdo, All right? Tiene un dent en la puerta. Ay, 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 what? Agolladura. Apachado, right. dent. All right. Ah, so what I want to say is that's not a that's not a noun. That's not a verb. That's a noun. Okay. Anyways, okay. If you want to take a look at the other answers, uh, watch the video on YouTube, guys, because I have two minutes to start my other class. Okay. Uh, Irena, right? You have one, right? Yes, teacher. Uh, just give me some. Um, what is will the future continues? Because I have problems with that. For example, in the number two, it says table, tablet, number two of what? Yes. The hold part on, three, on, right. part Wait. three, letter C. Part three. Oh, so not the midterm. Okay. I think it's the last one part. We, I don't know. Exactly. This one, this one we discussed. I asked you yesterday, guys, if we had questions regarding number section number three. This one is from yesterday, no, not today. I am in the last one, I guess. So but, um, it's okay, teacher. It's okay. I will try again, and I will ask you by the which chat. One, which one, right? Which one? Which one? Very quickly. So three, three, what? No, it's number four or five, I guess. Oh, we we have we are, we have not. Okay, no, no, no. Today we're not seeing number four. We're seeing the midterm. I'm gonna help okay. you. I'm gonna help everyone with number four. Don't worry, all right? We're gonna okay. see that on Monday, all right? Okay. Thank all you. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Thank you, guys. Okay. All right, guys. I have to run now, guys. Okay. Guys, do me a favor uh first of all thank you all for coming okay all right i really appreciate that try to join early guys so you understand right uh, i'll say this okay uh traten de venir temprano guys para que uno para que empecemos temprano y dos guys para que eh, entiendan un poco no, no sé cuál es el propósito guys eh, cuál es la meta de ustedes right mi propósito sería aprender right uh si completar la plataforma es fácil guys right but talking you know practicar y, y entender Um, véanlo como una gran oportunidad, como les dije en el día número uno, guys, 
um, la gente, guys, encontrar una persona que hable un idioma nativo y you uno know, en todo eso, cuesta, guys, un montón de dinero, right? So, véanlo como una oportunidad, right? Um, so, appreciate that, and uh, I think you're doing a great job, guys, okay? I just want to, solo es para que lo, lo piensen, okay? Got it? Gracias. Thank you, guys. Yo solo right. quiero saber si la otra semana tenemos clase toda la semana. Yes. Um, sí, de lunes oh, a jueves. Por, la, por, la, por las vacaciones. Yes. Le voy a decir, le voy a decir. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Here we go. Thank you.